All right, this will be a brief video because the alternating series test is quite straightforward. A series is alternating. If its terms are alternatingly positive and negative, we've seen an example of an alternating series before. Grandi is a series. The sum of negative one to the n minus one from one to infinity. The terms alternate between positive and negative. Grandi series is a divergent alternating series. Um, if you have an alternating series, how can you determine its convergence or divergence? Of the tests we've learned so far, we cannot attempt either the integral test or the comparison test or the limit comparison test. Those all require the terms to be a positive. We could attempt the root test or the ratio test, but frequently there's a very quick and easy way of saying that an alternating series converges. The appropriately named alternating series test. And the alternating series test is as follows. Suppose we have an alternating series and two conditions are satisfied. First, the limit as n goes to infinity of these terms is zero. Second, the terms of this series are decreasing. That is a sub one is greater than a sub two is greater than a sub three and so on. If we have both of these conditions, then this series converges. So just like the nth term test can only tell you when a series diverges, the alternating series test can only tell you a series converges.